Okay, let us head back to Dalaran. I will see about doing something else. Because, holy crap. Holy crap! Ugh. So what else is it I actually need to do? Uh, hmm, I'm not really sure. I have a brand new helmet. It's a lot better than this. A lot better than I could possibly make this. Because even with the uh, extra like bonus thing I could put on it. Let's see. Let's go take a look. Because I think if I put the um, uh, item level increase thing on it, it, I can put it up to like 820, maybe 830. So that is slightly below what I am currently wearing. Uh, where is it? Where is the vendor? Ah, here he is. What can I do for you? Ah, Eridic the Pure. So, yeah, I can, I can actually buy this to get it to 820, to 830, even up to 840 once I get honored. But that's basically it. So, yeah. Unfortunately, this helmet is now worthless to me, <laughs> which is sad to say, because, yeah, huh, it's actually worthless, though these, uh, this, bra these gloves are not. I could actually use these. These would be very nice. So I just need to get honored with those guys. Final boss in eight dungeons. Uh, class order campaign, which I still need to do. Um, anything else? Uh, anything else here? Squire Squad. Uh, basically nothing. So, yeah. Unfortunately, I could not increase my helmet any more than I already have. So, yeah, let's... Uh, I kind of want to go get a uh, gem and put it in there. In fact, I might have one in my bank that I can just slip in there for the time being. Let's go check that out, see if I do. And then I think I'm going to do is go do some more world quests, because there might be something good. In fact, uh, I might be able to get some mostly artifact power stuff. Ooh, here we go, shoulders. But that's a dungeon. Uh, any less, like, world stuff I could do? Ah, level 830 plate. Waste. Very nice. Uh, in fact, I might go do that. That's actually pretty good. And there's a uh, laystone thing here. Anything over here in High Mountain? Because I need to come up to High Mountain anyway for the other uh, my uh, blacksmithing quest. Ooh, 820 shoulders. They're not the heroics, but it doesn't look like there's uh, any need to do a dungeon for them. So yeah, I might go do that. Okay, uh, let me turn in this... Let me uh, dump this in my uh, bank, see if I have a gem I can stick in there, just for the time being. Okay, so I just need to kill the cultist leader, a bunch of plant guys, and then hopefully, ooh, maybe get that uh, rare up there. Cultist leader, where are you? Uh, he was right here, a second ago. See? What? Uh, oh, I guess he's inside the cave. Okay, let's kill this guy. Let's kill a bunch of plants and see if we can get this belt. Ah, because I really do want that belt. That belt would be a nice big boost. Because I am working towards being able to do heroics and like that. Uh, I don't think you actually need to, like, get uh, attuned or anything for heroics. Because that was one of the things in uh, Warlords of Draenor. Was it Warlords of Draenor? where you needed to be able to get through the scenario things in order to do heroics. I know it was like that in... I think that was... Was it Warlords of Draenor that it was that was added? Or was it Pandera that was added? That you had to do that in order to get into uh, heroics. I don't remember. I know it was there in Warlords, though. But unfortunately, nothing like that's here. You can just get 810 and just start doing heroics. Mainly because heroics are kind of a joke, to be honest. They they were simplified to the point that 
they're, they're no longer really heroics, or at least what heroics used to be. Uh, but yeah, that's that's just more, more, more me complaining about that kind of stuff. Which I don't really want to get into, because I'll just start ranting about that kind of stuff, and I don't want to do that. How do I get up there? There's a rare up there. I want to get the rare. Let me get the rare, you stupid plant. Uh, crap. Fine. You want to be that way? I'm just going to prune you. How do you like that? But yeah, I... I guess I should talk about that. I guess, maybe. I don't know. But heroics are kind of a joke in the sense that they're not nearly as hard as they used to be. And it kind of took away some of the fun. I mean, that's the whole. That was the whole point of heroics back in Burning Crusade, and Lich King was. They were so so crazy hard. And how do I get up there? I don't want to have to go all the way around, so I'm not going to screw it. Screw it. I'm not going to. What are the where are the cultivators? Ah, here we go. Let's kill all these stupid little plants. Huh. But yeah, they were so friggin' hard in Burning Crusade. I mean, granted, that was still during the time where uh, crowd control was mandatory. AoE tanking was only uh, available to, like, paladin tanks with their massive AoE damage from uh, Consecration. And, yeah, it was a lot harder back then. But even into uh, Wrath of the Lich King, heroics were no joke. They were not a joke. They, I mean, they were a bit simpler, a bit easier than they were in Burning Crusade, since everyone had the ability to crowd control. But at the same time, they were still fairly hard, especially once the uh, uh, that just appear. No, I need a cultivator. Cultivator? Yeah, there we go. But yeah, even once the uh, Ice Crown dungeons showed up, especially once they showed up, because they were geared towards people who had, like, basic raid gear. They weren't just, like, normal raid, uh, normal heroics. They were raid, you had to be, like, raid geared leveled heroics. So they were even harder than the standard heroics, which is why whenever uh, <laughs> Wrath of the Lich King uh, dungeons show up as as a uh, time walking stuff. They were so much harder. The ice crown ones were so much harder than the standard ones. They were just crazy hard. Come on, come on, come on, and a boo. Yes, got it. Aha. And is that no? I thought that was a treasure chest, but it's just a random herb. But yeah, st in like burn a uh, cataclysm. It got a lot easier, and it just kept going from there until heroics became kind of a joke. Now, once they added uh, mythic dungeons, you started getting that feeling back, that uh, sense of, this is really, really hard, and we really have to pay attention. We can't just zerg rush through it while uh, watching TV <laughs> kind of feeling. And it, it, it brought back some of that difficulty that people were missing from the dungeons, from just five-man dungeons. And it was not... It, people liked it, and that's one of the reasons they brought it back here. And, yeah, the, basically, mythic dungeons are the new heroics. They're what heroics used to be, and what they really should be. But, yeah, they basically become what the level... max-level dungeons used to be. Just something people did for a bit of gear and whatever the daily thing was. And holy crap, 850. An 850 waste. Holy crap, did you see that? Titan forged epic upgrade. It was only supposed to be like an 820, and now it's an 850. Holy crap. That, that's just wonderful. That is just wonderful. Thank you very much. Oh, I really do have to be so friggin' happy that I put the points into it. Uh, did I actually choose that? I don't remember. Did I ever cho uh, switch it back to get the bonus upgrade? A uh, chance to get bonus upgrades? I don't remember. But now I have to go get another gem. I am up to 802, though. 802 item level. 
So yeah, uh, oh. Let us... Wait. Crap. Was there something else? Uh... Oh yeah, there's this I wanted to do. We need to go do the cure and tour thing. Because that's what our, uh... Thing is. It's for cure and tour. And unlike the other ones, it's there's no like single dungeon, single zone we can go into and just do it all up. We just have to search around the map for it. Okay, let's make our way up there, and I will hopefully. Uh, is it on that little island? I think so. But yeah, I'll hopefully get this done. Is this the right one? I think so. Maybe. Not really sure. Ah, here it is. Leyline Enigmatic Solved. Enigma Solved. Uh, what? Puzzle. If we follow the path of display before, filling out the entire grid. Okay. What is this? Ooh. What? What? What just happened? Where am I? Uh. There's like something in here. And I got teleported out. Uh. Okay, let's... Follow the path. Crap. I was one block off. Okay, so it's just a path puzzle. So it's up, up, up. Up, up, up. Up. Okay. Bop, 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 bop. Bop, bop. There we go. Fairly simple. As long as you pay attention. And there we go. Enigma solved! That's one down. What did I get out of that? A spell book. Not too bad. But what is in here? Can I actually not go in here at all? Oh. Wait. It's just a little cave. Filled with these stupid little guys. Completely pointless waste of time. Huh. Okay, where do I want to head to next? I kind of want to go back and do this, but at the same time, I don't want anyone to sit there killing and mining just guys. Uh, so, yeah, let's see. I also want to head over to High Mountain. Because there was a shoulder thing up here somewhere. Here it is. So, it is right across from Skyhorn. Uh, Skyhorn or here? Which one's closer? Is there anything else other than, like, artifact power stuff? Doesn't really look like it. Just amazingly artifacts power. Okay, let us take the flight point thing. Head over to Skyhorn and see if we can get some shoulders out of this. Okay, here we go. Let's see if we can actually get some epic upgrades on these shoulders. Because if we get, I mean, that's two epics I've gotten today. I mean. Harpies are swarming the nesting grounds of our eagle allies. They huh? want a fight. Ha! Eh, we will don't really need that. Uh, the only thing, only problem I really see is the fact that I need three more Kirin tours, but unfortunately, uh, I've only found like three uh, other ones. There's like one in each zone, so I'd have to go all the way up here for this one. I think there's like one here somewhere, uh, or was it over? No, there's not one here at all. So I'd ha there's one here, one here, and one here. So I have to do all three of them. Uh, there is a uh, thing up there. I completely missed this. How did I miss this? 
Muck Snout. Muck Snout. I wonder if I could have pushed him off. There was like a prompt I could have clicked on him. I might have been able to push him off the mountain. Oh, that would have been funny. But, unfortunately, I clicked there before I uh, clicked him. Oh. Now, well. Ah, well. We just need to... Uh, viewing Harpy Slain. Fetish Destroyed. And Wildlife Slain. Here we go. Harpies from the Haglands are unleashing Let's destroy this. Magic upon uh, destroy that. Rats. Kill him. No. Wait. It's a horde player. I can't help. Unfortunately, I'd like to help. I would love to help. But I can't. Because you can't help the horde. Uh, but this is fairly nice. I mean, just redoing something like this. I mean, it would have been nicer if uh, I hadn't already done this. And I could still get credit for it. But, unfortunately, I can't. Because I don't think you can actually do the world the uh, b world bonus objectives after you hit 110. Because I actually tried. I've been to areas where there should have been bonus objectives, but they just weren't there. So I don't think you can actually do them. Because they turn into these. The bonus objectives actually turn into these objectives. So, yeah. Boom. Die. Die. Heal me. Crap. Nope. Nope. Oh. Stupid moose. Quit hitting me, you stupid moose. Ugh. Okay. Die. Heal me up. There. Ah. Uh. See, so, yeah, I don't... Th I have not actually seen any of the bonus objectives since I became 110. Even though I know there should be some there. So, I... Did I not get credit for that? No, I don't think I got credit for it. I was just outside the radius. And that's the only problem with this stuff. That's the, that is really the only problem I have with the bonus objective stuff. Is if you move slightly out of range of where the bonus area is, you don't get credit. I mean, at least with a standard quest, you can still kill them anywhere. As long as it's the right uh, target, as long as it's the right mob, as long as it's the right objective, you can still kill them and get credit, even if you're not in the specific area. Or if you run slightly out of it. But with the bonus objective, since it's not an actual quest in your inventory, in your quest log, if you move slightly out of range, you get kind of screwed over on that front. <laughs> ah, this should be the last one. And then we can go do that other Kirin Tor one. Hopefully, come on, epic, epic, epic upgrade. Ah, 825. Not too bad. Not great, but not too bad. Uh, Warforged, at least. 783. Uh, up to 804. And it, it is back to this. Uh, this one. This model. This design. Mm, not my first choice. But still pretty nice, I guess. So, yeah. Where is this? Uh, apparently there's a flight point here. How do I get to that? I'm not really sure. I have not been over there. I don't Who knows? There might actually be some quest or something down here. Because I have not been down here before. Hmm. Uh, anyone? No? No. Hmm. Nothing. Friendly people? Friendly Torin? Friendly moose guys? Oh, at least I got the flight point. I have to say, at least, I got the flight point. Uh, trash, 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 trash. Uh, ooh. A gleaming rock. Wait, it's the same thing, isn't it? Delicate, gleaming. Oh. Yeah, okay. Trash and trash and trash. Hmm. Okay. So, where is this I need to go? It's straight down. 
off the mountain that away. Oh. Ooh, crap. What is this? So it looks like it's right down there. Uh. Oh. Okay, that's not the right way. That's just, it's just a complete drop off the cliff. Uh. Okay, fine. Fine. Jump and bubble. Bubble jump! Here we go. It'll save me one whole glider if I do this. Ooh. For a second there, I thought I fell in water. Now, what the hell? This fog is very thick. Very heavy. And it goes all the way down here, but just stops right at, at the line. Ah. Is this going to be another puzzle thing? Maybe. Uh, Kieran Tor stuff usually is probably weird. Yeah, it's another box. Another box. Holy crap! And it uh, another level is the fact that uh, it's underwater too. Was it up? And over? Okay. Three by three. So one two. One two, one two, one two. Ah, oh, damn it! Damn it! I went off the path. So bop, bop, bop. The distortion of the water is a bit. Uh. So. Here, 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 and, uh, oh, crap, yes, got it, got it, another one done. Uh, sucks that it only gives me artifact power, but at the same time, fairly nice. Uh, now I just need two more of these damn things. Uh, one's in Suramar, and one is in Azuna. Uh, let us go ahead and teleport back to Dalaran. I'll do these two, hopefully, do these two, and then maybe, just maybe, I'll get something good out of it. Uh, maybe another piece of gear. In fact, that would be very nice. Because I am up to 804. So I just need a couple more pieces to get me up to 810. Fell blaze. There we go. Ah, okay. Let's see, is this another light puzzle? Is it another light puzzle? No, I think it's a race or something. Uh. Ah, here we go. So I just have to follow this. The lay race. The lay race. Okay. Uh. Huh. So which direction do I go? Uh, it's not too bad. Basically just a race. I think I've got five minutes. Uh, this way. We just have to keep an eye out for those. Bop. And... Bop. And, uh, ba 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 There's a quest right there. I missed it. I might have to come back at some point. Or I might just say screw it. Because I think I already got the achievement for this. Uh, achievement for this zone. And that that box is still bugged. That's the one that ha that was from uh yeah those guys. Crap! I kind of missed it and got stuck on a rock. I got stuck on a rock. Uh. Come on, we just need to speed up a little bit. 
We just need the speed. Need the need the speed. It's up to seventy. Holy crap! No! 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 Huh? At least they're not aggroing. It looks like they do not aggro on you, which is fairly nice. Uh. But yeah, look at this. This is slightly different. This is. I have to admit, this is different than what I was really expecting. I mean, you normally expect kill, go out and kill like 50 guys, or whatever. But instead, huh, it's just a race. It's like a friggin' race, just a normal race. And that's three. Uh, what did I actually get from this? Just a reputation? Not too bad. So, j now I just need whatever this one is. Item found. Uh, did I actually get the Iron Grove? Maybe. If I got the Iron Grove, I'll fly up there. Azeroth must not fall. Nope. Okay, we just have to run from Meridil. Death to the leaf. I think I went the right way. <laughs> uh, I have not been up here yet. I, I, I've done a bit of this stuff, I just haven't explored everywhere or every single nook and cranny. If there isn't a, like a quest or something that sends me, I haven't really explored nearly as much as I probably should have. Uh, ooh. Castellon. Oh, it's Archmage Castellon. I was expecting Archmage What's-His-Face. The one that I always gets summoned by that stupid staff. Uh, look here. The orbs of lay energy seem to influence some sort of... So, what is it? It's a bubble. What is it I have to do? I'm guessing I have to click on something? Item found. What item? The Nightborn continue to lay siege to the Moon Guard stronghold. What Should item am I looking for? To their arrogance. Is it this item? I mean, there is this, but yeah. Is it down here somewhere? Quite possibly. I don't know. Ah, here it is. How do I get to it, though? Uh, <laughs> do I have to get into a bubble? I'm guessing I have to get, get into one of these bubbles. Here it is. Uh, how do I get into the bubble? Ah, here we go. Aha! Uh -huh. Fairly simple, fairly easy. Crap, and I can't do it while I'm mounted. And, ah, uh, almost. Yes! Aha! Very nice. So, that is all four of them, I think. There we go. That is all four of them. And, crap. I just wasted it. Uh, is there anything else here I want to do? Eh. Blah. Uh, worm. Power. Nothing. Well, I, I could go do this for, like, uh, more resources, because I do need tons and tons of resources. I just don't feel like doing it right now, because I kind of need to take a break again. Because this is the second recording session I've done today, and this is, like, three hours worth of stuff. So, yeah. Even though it doesn't get, it doesn't actually come out as three hours, because I cut it down a bit. Uh, so, is there anything else? I don't think so. So let's head back to Dalaran. I'll turn this in. I think it is Dalaran that I have to send this, right? Yeah, right there. So I'm going to head back, turn this in, maybe get a new piece of gear. Okay, here we go. Uh, hopefully we get something good. Because, holy crap. Uh, oof. Now there is something I've been wondering. If I pick up a piece of gear and I can't actually use it myself or it's not for my class, but it's soul bound to me, does it still get added to my um 
uh, rec uh, collection stuff for the appearances because I did get this when I was doing Corin Dire Brew, the Dire Brew Bloody Shanker. It's a dagger, so I can't actually use it, but was it added? I don't really know. Collected, not collected. Uh, so I don't really know. It's one of those things. It's. Is it added here? Uh. Sword, maces, axes. I can't really tell because since I can't use it, it doesn't show up for me. Ooh, what is this? Reputation with the Valjar. Reputation with the Nightfallen. Ooh, only 750 with Nightfallen? That kind of sucks. But the Valjar, the Highborn, all nice. Huh. Who do I need the most rip with? Let's go with the uh, High Mountain Tribes. There we go. So, nice chunk with a High Mountain. Get 500 more of that. And, what did we get? 805. Well, not too bad. It's better than what I had on. I still need to get some more gems, though, which is unfortunate. Because I have a Jewel Crafter. I actually do have a Jewel Crafter. It's my rogue. And I have not even touched him yet. So, yeah. I'm going to have to get a new one. Uh, I'm just going to have to go get some gems off the auction house. Unless they're like 50,000 gold. In which case, screw that. <laughs> uh, but, since I do have such good gear now, and a lot of it is uh, stuff I'm going to be keeping, uh, I guess it's about time that I actually do this purple paladin here we go 349 gold and it is so freaking worth it just so I actually match oh look at this look at this my classic purple paladin gear that I was wearing in the very first video before it got all mismatched by just constant re <laughs> replacements uh, okay, it wasn't really constant. More like a trickle of replacements. But yeah, this is my purple paladin set. Uh, I should probably change out the weapon, but I kind of want to keep the classic Ashbringer, at least for the time being. Simply because. I do like the Ashbringer. It's one of the few uh, artifact weapons that is actually, like, part of the lore. I mean, there are some others that were actually around and talked about in the lore in the stories but the ashbringer is one of the few that was actually like really integral to the storylines that all the way back to vanilla so yeah i don't really want to replace it i want to keep it even though every other paladin has one <laughs> which is hilarious but yeah i finally finally have good enough gear that I don't really have to worry about replacing it all the damn time. That I can finally have myself transmogged to my classic, classic purple paladin uh, from Burning Crusade. Ah, okay. What I think I'm going to do is I'm going to stick this back in my bank since I'm not going to be wearing it. I don't want to wear a tabard with this since it's like a complete set. So yeah, uh, I can sell that. And I can stick my tabard of the protector that I got during the uh, Burning Crusade launch back in the bank. Where is it? Where is my tabard thing? Tabards, tabards, tabards. Here we go. Ah, there we go. So, uh, I'm going to take a break here and come back next time. Uh, I don't think there's anything I really need to do right now, so... Uh, don't think there's anything I need to do uh, on my own. I kind of want to head over here and start the uh, demon steel stuff, but I, w I think I'll wait for next time because there might be something interesting with that. Uh, if not, I'll probably cut it out. But I might go ahead and go do some more, like world quests that give me some uh, like resources, because I do need tons and tons of resources, so I might do that in between here and now, like going to kill some, kill that guy, 
or just like normal quest stuff. But yeah, anyway, thanks for watching. This has been Bobson. This has been more World of Warcraft. This is me as my purple paladin self here. Uh, right back where I should be. <laughs> so, anyway, thanks for watching, and until next time, I will see you later. Bye.